And then for today, uh, the ArchiCAD tip of the week we're going to review is how to customize shortcuts. Again, you would go to the Options menu, you would go to Work Environment, and you would click Select Work Environment. This would open up the Work Environment Settings. Now, the Work Environment Settings is where we create uh, the a, a saved settings that are specific for your personal preferences. Those per per personal preferences can be for everything from how you arrange your screen, meaning your palettes, um, and the way that, that your screen looks, to the background color of your screen, grid color of your screen, uh, could be for the way that you organize your toolbars, and of course for shortcuts as well. You want to select the shortcuts option here um, in your work environment, and then you want to uh, locate and select a command that you want to change and or add a keyboard shortcut to. A really good example is Stretch. Stretch doesn't actually have a shortcut. Many years ago it did, but I think they had so many different new shortcuts they were adding every time they had new features to ArchiCAD that this one kind of uh, got left by the wayside. Uh, so if you want to, one of the ones I, I often do with the shortcut here is I add Control H. The way you would do that is you would first select by going into your menu structure here, go find the menu that you want. Reshape, of course, is under the Edit menu. Uh, then we would go down to Stretch. You would see it has does not have a desired shortcut uh, assigned to it. If you select a command and it has a signed shortcut, you'll see it here, and then you can change that if you want. In this case, we select this, then we click into, really important, you need to click into the shortcut uh, um, uh, field here. Then you go to your keyboard and you click the commands, uh, the, 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 the keyboard sequence commands that you want, in this case, Control and H. So I, I click those two keyboard um, uh, uh, keys together. Once I've done that, I then go and store that short but shortcut um, uh, profile or scheme, excuse me. So I basically then click on shortcut schemes right here, and you'll see that there's the standard shortcut schemes. I want to store my shortcut schemes for this. So I'm going to click store as. I'm going to type in my name. It could just be my standard shortcuts. I'm going to go store. And then finally, you're going to go to the very top level here to work environment profiles. And you'll see here's your standard work environment profiles, layout profile, productivity profile, standard profile, and visualization profile. These are all presets that you can change. Standard is the one you see out of the box when you first open ArchiCAD. Now what you want to do is you want to go create a new profile. This will come up, and you'll, you can type in a new name for this. You just call it My Profile. But notice under this now it has a shortcut scheme for My Standard Shortcuts. So should you change or update or add any new shortcut uh, commands in the future, you can update this one option here under your shortcut schemes, and that will then update your profile. You don't have to go back to this anymore. And then once you've done that, go OK. That will then appear in your profile options. And the way you access that is whenever you now create a new project, make sure you select your profile, and then that will enable your uh, shortcuts as well as any other changes you may have done to um, the profile of uh, the work environment for this particular um, profile. Or if you already have a project open, you can simply go to your options menu, work environment, apply profile, and my profile.